this is a lockdown circuit to um, lock your base down should it be attacked. Uh, start with the alarm switch. This does require the battery to be charged with uh, at least two power. So to start with, we take the power out of the battery and put it into the branch. That's a power of one out of it. That goes around to the smart switch. And then from the smart switch to the next electrical branch, which we set two. From the smart switch, we go to the alarm and then to the transmitter. And then on the second bit, uh, we go from here down to the alarm switch off. All right, from this side, we go up to the seismic sensor and then to the switch on. That's this, the alarm switch done. Onto the seismic sensor. This is really simple. Um, it's only three components. So what we do is we go from the battery out, the seismic sensor, and then literally from the seismic sensor down to the transmitter. I would set that as frequency six for now. This is just for demonstration. We'll change this to six. Right, this is the lockdown circuit itself I don't, I'm not sure why I'm skipping ahead right this is a locked uh, down circuit this is off a car battery so it allows you to do six doors you can use larger batteries to do more more doors right so let's make a start this we'd set to two then from the out of here we take it down to your RF receiver which again we set to six then up to the set on then from the other side we go to the power and then out of here we go straight to the next branch now this goes all the way into the circuit now this this one however turns the turns the memory switch back off so it's only on for a split second right so once we uh, we set this to 12 it'd be right then we go up along here to the first one to turn the door then from here these would be set to one, by the way. Uh, we did go to the close, so the uh, cyan goes to the close. The blue goes to your second branch, and then you just repeat. So you connect this one to the next group, and then do the bottom one to your close, and then top one to your power, and then you just go along and do the others. I've only set up two doors for this particular one. Again, all the uh, branches to the doors we set to uh, set to one. All right, so this is a uh, shoot. We'll open one. We'll open both. Take a shot. Ah, need to uh, put explosive ammo in. So we now take a shot. You see both doors close. So now we're going to open one of the doors. And do the same. And you know, notice it, the doors just close. They don't cycle up and then down. They, they'll just only close if they're open. Right, now we can do it with a switch. And the same thing happens. A closed door will not open. And that's it.